Hello, welcome back to my channel. I wasn't planning on filming right now, but I'm inspired and I feel like I need to do it. So we're making a video. This video is strictly going to be about like decorating my kitchen and my open shelves and bar cart because they have been like a constant work in progress since we've moved into this apartment. And I finally have a couple hours free for an afternoon. And so I think I'm gonna take my butt up to CP2 and get some stuff to kind of like actually build it out and design it. Cause I just have not spent the time doing it. Also I'm wearing a shirt with my friend Katie's face on it. Cause I got it for her graduation and it's just really comfortable. Anywho, I thought that this would be kind of an interesting video because you guys are often looking for like decor tips from me and since we've moved in i just put everything in its place and then haven't touched many things but our bar cart's just not done like it just hasn't been done it's time and then the open shelves i was planning on just doing the bar cart today and then i looked at the open shelves next to them and i was like i hate this so we're gonna tackle that too i've already done like a couple things just as i was like immediately inspired and then i was like okay i need to move some stuff around so i'll kind of show you where we're at as of now so this is our bar cart she's super cute i wish i could put that alexa on it but the bar cart's made of like glass and metal and it rattles too much down here this is all of the alcohol as well as like ginger beers and simple syrup and stuff I just moved all of this it was not like this before all of this junk was on there this was on there those gotta go switched out the plant I put all my cookbooks because I think they look really cute all nice and stacked there this is a like shaker set that uh, my partner Stephanie gave me and then this is a cute little like Chicago outline cutting board I thought that'd be kind of cute to use instead of a tray and then I'll put like a couple bar cart pieces up there and then the rest of the glassware down below so I need to go to CBT to get the stuff for this but I think that that'll look really nice and then this is just a hot flaming pile of garbage I hate how it looks right now so I need to climb up there and move some things around because I feel like I can do this well it's just not there yet staring out the window reaching for a north star waiting just to wake up from this nightmare where you could be right back in my arms dancing to the limbo Stuck here in the middle You tell me that it's simple but I could Okay, it's still not my favorite, but I moved a bunch of the jars up front. Kind of changed around this. This guy was just like too big. I feel like it was overwhelming. So, you know, I have the clock, one of the Pileas, a bowl that I got from QXY, a bunch of the jars. Moved the fruit bowl up there, which I feel like I'm kind of into, and then another plant. And then I'm thinking this candle, which I had over there, might look really cute, just like there, or even here. Now I gotta figure out where to put this. I don't know. These are hard. I feel like all of my other previous open shelves I could work with really well, but these are like not easily like accessible and just harder to style. Hmm, I'm torn. Okay, okay, another update. My patio is filthy because I've been working with plants all day, but I moved this guy out here and then I wrapped its little vines around the railing and I feel like she's kind of cute. What do you think? Do you like it? Is it good? Okay, I need to get out of this outfit because I'm gonna go to CB2. Also, I ordered a piece of art to go there and we looked at so many pieces of art of what we could have done and honestly, I'm so excited. Okay, motorcycle, so rude. I'm talking. I was gonna take the bus, but there's no arrival times for my stop at all. So I'm gonna ride a bike or walk. I'm not gonna take the bus though. I can tell you that. Fit of the day, got my Nikes. I feel like I, tall socks might be kind of nerdy, but that's okay. And then just black jeans, black leather jacket. And this is absolutely a piece of lingerie, but I love it. So I'm gonna wear it today. All right, off we go. Bone got a couple cracks on it. Oh, well, big boy on the retina. People showing tell something spicy in my drink. Do my dance like turning tag with a waist that uh, she make a boy act dumb. She knows she hot, she knows she pretty. She's a for wet, the steam is all dizzy. I feel eh, I feel. So the bus was also like not coming on my way home and Alex is already home now and I was kind of like killing time for him this afternoon because he had a soccer game and it's our anniversary and we're gonna go to get dinner and drinks and stuff now and so I wanted to get home quicker and so I rode an electric bike but I realized why the buses aren't coming is because basically the entire road that is like the quickest route to get home is closed for construction so I literally just had to carry an electric bike up and down so many steps and these glasses they're like wrapped but I could just hear them all like shaking and I'm like oh my god they're so thin too like they're beautiful and thin but they might very well crack we'll see did the goods make it i do not know all right i have returned sound with the goods. Hold on, I'm so thirsty. Okay, let's see how they look. I will say too, I was so pleasantly surprised with the prices at CB2. Like I thought these were gonna be way more expensive and they feel 
so nice. Like they are thin and classy. This is my favorite. Like this is just the prettiest. So I got two of these. These ones I want to put up top because I think they're just so beautiful. And then I got four of these ones. These ones are like they feel smooth from the outside, but the inside is very. I thought they like complement each other really nicely. Somehow I need to get the stickers off of all of them. And then we've never owned wine glasses. Actually, I think when we lived in Arizona, we did. I feel like we got a bunch of like family hand-me-downs with things, but I didn't want to get like full wine glasses, A, because I was afraid they'd topple over and shatter, and B, then there's red and white, and I didn't want to get two sets, so I just got two of these stemless ones. All right, let's set them up. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, I definitely need to take all the stickers off because on the bottoms, it's so bad because it's black, so you see them so clearly. But what do you think, Lou? Does it look beautiful? I think it looks so nice. I'm really happy with like this little setup up top. I like the little shot glass. No, I think I don't. So cute. Okay, I think it looks great. I just gotta take the stickers off. I need to move the Alexa wires because that's driving me bonkers. And then our piece of art will go there. She's still a work in progress. I didn't, I looked at CB2 for like a bunch of like open shelvy things that I could put there and I didn't like anything. So I'm not, I don't know what to do with this. Okay, I did it. I removed all the stickers. They look so good. I am so happy with this. It used to just be like so incredibly cluttered. Now I feel like it actually has like purpose. Yay, now we just need the art. All right guys, exciting update. I feel like I'm finally gonna be able to finish this vlog. Are you, are you still eating so much pizza? Oh, is that your same piece? It's just the crust. Oh. What's up guys, what's the update? Our bar cart art is here. Mmm. There you go. Lulu, Lulu, Lulu. Is it tasty? Okay. Alice, you want to help me unbox? I'm so excited to do this. We were not that saying it came really fast. Okay, I did. All right, that one's the frame if you want to grab the frame. I think this is the most I've ever spent on a piece of art. I guess except for the neon sign. How much you spent on? It was like 300 including the frame. It was like 300 including the frame. Wait, or was it? No, 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 it was not. It was 200. Oh. All right, for our Chicago people, this is the building. It says the name. What does it say? I don't even know what it's called. Car biting carbon. It's the building in a loop that looks like a champagne bottle. So I thought it'd be really cute to go above our bar cart because, like, on theme, on brand, you know. Both Chicago and alcohol. Both Chicago and alcohol. Two of my favorite things. Oh, there's already art in here. No. Free art. In a view in my bed. I'm down at this waistline, right below your waistline. Want you by my head. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. I do like it. I like it. I think it's cool. I think it complements our living room really nicely. Yeah, it's it's like the green, like the couch. And the yellow, like the sign. Yeah. Just mock where it'll go up. Oh, very cool. Will you hang it now? Um, yeah, I'll do that for you. We'll show them when it's hung. Okay. I love it. Ta-da! This is it. This is my bar cart. Yeah, it looks great. This is our bar cart. We, we did it together. Just kidding, I did all of it, but you hung the paint. I'm here for emotional support on this gloomy day. Guys, well that's it. That's all she wrote. She's all done and dusted, and she's looking so cute. What do you think? Do you think it looks so cute? Do you think you're so cute? Tiny love of my life, but I can never make you a cocktail from my bar cart. Not even one time. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here. I feel like I used to do way more of these like dedicated videos where they had like a specific theme and I was doing like one specific thing and I don't really do that many of those anymore. So if you liked this, please let me know. I feel like I'm having a big like internal struggle right now of like what does my channel like continue to look like in the future and I would love to hear your thoughts. So let me know if you have any questions or anything. As always, feel free to comment down below. I'll try and pull the link. All the cups came from CB2 and I'll try and pull the link for the art as well because she's beautiful. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, hit that big red subscribe button. I post a video every three days and I would love for you to follow along. Also follow me over on Instagram. I post a lot of content over there as well. And I'd love to connect. But yeah, we made it this far. Thanks so much for watching. Love ya. Mean it. Really appreciate you. <laughs> and I'll see you next time.